the biggest thing that went through my head is this could happen to anybody at any time. But it happened to 65 year old Yvonne Cody, who friends say traveled everywhere with her Labrador Retriever. Police say Cody's car was struck by a Ford F-350 pickup truck on Putnam Pike in Gloucester, Rhode Island Sunday night. Police say 25 year old Travis Bullio was behind the wheel of the truck. They allege that he was passing cars in front of him, traveling in the opposite lane and collided with Cody's Volkswagen Beetle. Albert Schmidt, who was leaving Walmart Sunday evening, says he noticed Bolio's driving behavior. The truck was tailgating us um, all the way up the road. There's five people in front of me. The truck was behind us. Um, as soon as we crossed into the Rhode Island line, and it turned to two lanes before the truck even had a chance to get into the two lanes, he just jumped into the oncoming lane. Schmidt says immediately he reacted. I went up to the car. I called 911. I went up to the passenger side of the car first. I didn't see anybody in the car. I noticed a dog trapped in the back seat. When police arrived, Cody was pronounced dead on the scene of the crash. Her dog buddy also did not make it. Now all that is left are memories of Cody. A black bunting hung on the hair chair salon sign, a business she owned for over 30 years. If you needed something done, Yvonne was the girl to go to. She was always there to help people. Volio has been charged with driving so as to endanger, resulting in death, and he's being held on a $25,000 bond. Reporting in Putnam, Carmen Chow, Fox 61 News. You ask, we answer. We know so many of you have questions about COVID-19 and the vaccine, especially now that the new vaccine plan has been released by the governor. Yeah, we know it can be confusing.